And then there were three. We move into the 184 pound weight class. Max Astrin of Missouri, 19 and two record, a three time All-American taking on the number one seed from Boise State, 29 and 0. Did not place in the 09 tourney, but Boise State, the Broncos, a program certainly on the rise. You know, what's one interesting thing about this at 84, the winner of this match for their team puts them into the top 10. Whoever wins this match will put their team into the top 10. Missouri and Boise State, two program Neutral. builder coaches, Neutral. Greg Randall and Brian Smith. I think there's a contrast in style. Smith, traditional forward offense versus Askren. Funky, a little unorthodox. And he can put you on your back. And, and this Don't position neutral. right here favors Don't Askren. Neutral. Max Askren, the younger brother of Ben Askren, and two-time national champion at Missouri. I got blood red. Blood that is red. not how Kirk Smith wanted to start blood this out. Red. No, he had a great position, but he just couldn't finish. And there is Ben Askren helping us out on ESPNU earlier this week, a two-time national champion himself. And uh, he's been there before. He knows exactly what his little brother is going through. Cleaning up a small cut on the forehead of Kirk Smith, the junior from Boise State, the Pac-10 champion. A three-time Pac-10 champion as we check in with Quint Kesner. Well, Ben uh, and Max, the brother, admitted having a heart-to-heart -heart okay, uh, prior to the Nationals, and they talked about fear and reasons for choking. Uh, Max has had great regular seasons in the past, but he's come here and underperformed. Uh, it starts to crumble for some reason, but not this year. I asked Ben exactly what was discussed. He sent me a text. He says, the results explain themselves. He wants to keep it in the family. Kirk Smith had a test as far as a funky wrestler who can cradle you with improve. Cannon from American in the in the semifinals, and he passed that test in flying colors. He won 11 to two. He ripped Cannon and never even came close to be putting in a, a cradle. But Askren, if he can get the legs in and funk you, I mean, you never count him out from anywhere. I just thought maybe Kurt Smith might be too strong and solid for Askren to successfully get funky. And yeah, that makes sense, but you know, Askren's body's a lot different than Cannon's too, and there's that funk. Wow. Two, three, four. I got two count, two count, two count. I got two, two. Askren gets the near fall point of two, so he now goes up four nothing. He's also accumulated enough riding time going over the one minute mark. So in effect, Max Askren of Missouri up 5-0 on Kirk Smith, the number one seed of Boise State. What I'm impressed with here about Askren is he is getting after it. Now what he's gonna have to do is stay after it. Exactly. Okay? But man alive. The guy is going for it. Yeah, he's jumping sides. He's getting out to the side. A lot of people ride behind. He's out to the side attacking you. Our thanks to Ben Askren for helping us out. He did a great, nice opening piece and just really summed it all up. Seven minutes to a national championship as he looks on his younger brother. A quick reminder, the NCAA Women's Basketball Championship continues on ESPN by Capital One. It is Sunday with first round regional games on ESPN and ESPN2 at noon and at 2.30 Eastern time. Check your local listings for the team matchups. Set. Missouri's last champion. That Force wiry was. Ellis last year. That wiry long body of Askren really poses a problem when he's on top. He's close Five. again. D D uh, high. Oh, and he's got it stuck deep. We might have a fall. Three near fall Neutral. points added to the total of Max Askren. One escape point going to Kirk Smith, so he finds himself in a hole of 7-1, make it 8-1 with the riding time. Well, this is where Borschel found himself yesterday. He came all the way back. Kirk Smith cannot panic here, but right now, Askren having his way. And do you think it's just the style of Askren that Kirk Smith is just having a hard time trying to figure out? I think it's because Askren surprised him, got in, got the takedown, and went to his style right away. And so Askren made it work, and he is just so good in the funk. Yeah, Smith was in on a beautiful shot. He just got countered down. 
And from that point on, it has not worked for Smith. Kirk Smith yet to be defeated this year, 29 and 0, three-time Pac-10 champion. Going up against Max Asper, the two-time Big 12 champion. And the first period comes to a conclusion, so two more sessions. Red is yours. Stop on neutral fur. Red's going to the fur. Red to first, green to the bottom. Is that green? Hey, we're going to go off, okay? We're gonna go and he, and he chooses a point Cover. is what, really what happens Check. because Kirk Smith going to give Run. him that takedown neutral. because he's really we're so neutral. good on his feet and solid that he doesn't want to stay on the mat. Nice. He needs to continue to pressure under control, but right to continue guys. to pressure. Askren control on Smith's right of hand. That's big hand fighting. Smith, one of several juniors on Boise State's team. They're a team to be reckoned with next year. We talk about the West and the influence of the coaches. Greg Randall from Iowa. Missouri have had a lot of success in the last few years. And Askren, of course, trying to follow his brother, Ben's example, two-time NCAA champion, Hodge Trophy winner, Ben Askren. Great Help. influence in his yeah, uh, brother's helping life. Helping Randall up there at Boise State is Chris Owens. So you get an Iowa guy, an Oklahoma State guy in there. And then Kirk right, White's in the corner, a former NCAA side. champion. Askren doing what he needs to do, tie Smith up. And keeping him on the outside of the mat right there. Askren doing a great job right now of controlling this match. Well, you look at the two body types, Kurt Smith in the Boise State singlet, small, compact bowling ball, just tough, and the wiry Max Askren out in front now, 8-1, plus a point for riding time. Look at that, he's got that leg right next to him, but the left hand of Askren controlling the right hand of Center. Smith. Center. Right the center, guys. Right now, there's no the stall warnings right here, and just there's got to be a more sense of urgency for Kirk right Smith. Center. Askren can hang around right now without really costing him too much. Because Askren right now is just backing right center, away. Guys. He's trying to circle in. Right the center. Not too hard. Six seconds, guys. Six seconds. Just enough. We're in here. Right, so they will go to the third period with Max Askren up 8-1, make it 9-1 by way of riding time, the extra point. Kirk Smith finds himself in a hole as Ben Askren, Max's older brother and two-time national champion from Missouri, watches on. You notice Smith wouldn't even go down. Yeah. Yeah. He, 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 he turned he, twice. He, he, he I wouldn't want to go there either. See if Smith can get something going here with a front headlock. Bounce Askren's head, try to take the corner. Boise State last had a champion when Ben Charrington won in 2006. Askren, has, seconds. Askren has matched his brother's three-time All-American status. There's a shot, he needs to come up, and he gets the two. That's what he wanted to do in the first period. He wasn't able to get her done, and then Askren took it from there. So Kirk Smith on the board now with the two points for the Blood. takedown. Blood. He's drilling all over here. Hey, man. He's in a clean position. He wasn't turning. I'm like, why wait until he scores? Eight three, Max Askren on top. Eight three, his brother Ben looking on. Two time national champion. It was always about the fro, fear the fro back in the day. And this kid, talk about an explosive wrestler. And he was a four time All American, Ben Askren. And Max becomes the first multiple three or more since his brother. Two time national champion in 06 and 07. Neutral. Neutral. Won the last 87 matches. Four-time finalist. He likes this riser and that. Final 50 seconds in this one. This is the 184-pound class. This is for a national title. It's Max Askren in the gold from Missouri on top of Kirk Smith of Boise. 
9-3. Smith has gotten a little bit hesitant. He's not really firing in like he did the first time. Maybe he'll go upper body here, 30 seconds. Need something big. Ask him a cool customer knows what he's got in his hand. Final 15 seconds. Look at the hand control. And Missouri looks like they will finish in the top 10 in the team standings. Final five seconds in the 184 pound class and Mr. and Mrs. Askren, you have two children that are national champions. Max Askren gets the victory in 184 over Kirk Smith. He is your national champion, the senior and two-time Big 12 champion joins his older brother as a national champion wrestler from the University of Missouri. Great job. We now send it down to Quint Kesnick. Max, what was one key to getting that early lead and setting the tempo? Uh, mentality, you know, I mean, it was the first, first match. It felt great, you know. Uh, all the pressure was off. Win or lose, my career's over. Um, I went out there, I've done what I've always done. I've done what I've done in practice. And, you know, I've been a little bit, uh, I guess I would say bashful in my technique, but uh, I came out there. You said you had a heart-to-heart -heart with your brother early in the week. What was discussed? Uh, you know, I, I guess the discussion was you know, why, why I clam up, why I choke, why I choke in these why, situations, what, you know, compared to practice where things just come. You know what, I mean? what changed this week? You know, honestly, it didn't feel like a whole lot in the beginning. You know, I was, I was uh, super tense, super anxious before all my matches. And uh, I, I don't know if that talk, you know, equated to before the finals. It felt great. I went out and performed, but uh, things worked. And uh, you know, thanks to my brother, thanks to everyone. Thank you. Congratulations. You have your own legacy now. Congratulations to Max Askren of Missouri getting the victory. And there's his big brother. A great moment for the Aspen family. Two brothers, two national champions.